Hi guys, so I'm going live and I'm doing a spooky haul and I'm going to be talking to quiet voice. I'm not going to be whispering, but I'll be showing you guys what I bought and I went to Michael's and my local grocery store. So this hat, it comes from Michael's. It's by Imagine 8. And it's like really pretty and glittery. It has this really pretty rose, these satin ribbons. And this is actually my daughter's wig. I mean, wig, hat. So I'm just gonna try it on. So you guys can see it even has like a little curve. So um, yeah, this is not this is not going to be mine, but I'll just try it. So um, this is what the inside looks like. It's really well made. I mean, I like how they made it wrinkly on top. It's not your typical blah, boring witch hat. So, love that. Next thing I picked up were this really cool, pretty floral um, arrangement skull. And I love how it has like the pink and the black. It's very Victorian. So cute. So I'm going to be making something with this. I might even have it back here for some decor. You might see that in the future. So next thing I picked up. really cute headband witchy little hat with the the veil so I got this at Michael's and it's so cute this is Layla's what I said my hair this is for Layla she likes she picked this out so that's hers um, the next thing I got were these really cute cupcake Happy Halloween um, little uh, papers because we're going to make some cupcakes and also some chocolates and candy with these brain, this little brain mold. It's like that silicone and Sasha wanted to make pink brains. So we're going to do that. Really baking. The next thing I got, oh my goodness, I got this cute yoga skeleton. Hi y'all. And this is from Michael's. This was on sale for $5 and I could not pass this up. So he's meditating or something. And I'm going to set this somewhere. Um, because they look cute. Next thing I bought, oh, they had this really cute voodoo doll or poppet um, near the flowers, like the floral section, the fall floral section. And I'm gonna also make something with this. I think this will be really cute back here because it has like a touch of pink. And I'm gonna like do something with these together. I don't know, but I'm already trying to incorporate the black and white for the Halloween. I might maybe pin them to my curtains. I might go back and find more of these because I only saw one left. Okay. So, um, this is probably going to be my favorite. Next, I got stickers. So I got two sticker books and they're just Halloween stickers. Uh, I like to put them on my packages during the season when I send out if you guys order my level up cosmetics you'll know that you'll always see a sticker on it sometimes so I like to put that on the envelopes or the packaging um ooh, they can be five dollars so I got a face mask I'm always selling those and here are, I told 
So I should put these in here anyway. I told her not to get these. They're just red candy nails. And she wanted to make the chocolates and the brand of candies. So we're going to mix it with some white, but I bought pink. They're sprinkles for the cupcakes. And gray, black, and eyeballs. And we also got these eyeballs for the cupcakes. Sasha. It's gonna be fun. Oh, I also got this really pretty. Called pink -a -boo. It's like a girly Halloween themed papers, scrap looking paper. So it's like the pinks and all that color. And y'all, I'm loving these. I'll show you guys these. Cute. has like the gold. And I'm gonna peel these stickers off. Get these stickers off. Thank you. I didn't do anything with my hair today. I just put it up in a bun because it was raining all day. And I was out doing things. this in a frame of some sort. Look at that. Oh, so smooth. Okay. Yes. There's ghosts. at Michael's for $5.99. It's by Recollections. So you might probably get it on sale. Too. I love this. Okay. Oh, look at this. This is the poisonous oleander container and it opens up. probably keep something in here like um mm, I don't know yet I have to think about it what would you keep in here oh y'all wait till I get to the grocery store stuff These are like $1.99 at Michael's. And 
I love the way that sounds. So I've got this. Uh, it looks like a little Patron bottle. I also got another bottle. This is like a flat round. This is also one ninety nine. And the cork comes out. Um, so this is a good, you can make a really good essential oil with this. If you put like some herbs in there and um, fill it with some type of oil and you can see the herb, it'll be like very aesthetic. So I think these are really good for those types of things. Um, I think a rosemary or a lavender would be really pretty or a mixture. Um, but you can also use this for whatever you like. If you're trying to have like a vintage theme in your bathroom, you could do like, uh, put some bubble bath in there or something like that. Yes. Or this one. This looks like a genie in a bottle or like some potion off of Hogwarts or something. I found this in the little glass section of Michael's and it's like... This is also one ninety nine, so very good, very good, very good prices at Michael's. Oh my God, this game! So, since a lot of people probably aren't going to be trick or treating this year, I got this game for us to play on Halloween, and it's like you spin the wheel and you have to do whatever it says. So it has things like tell two truths and a lie, um, don't blink for 30 seconds, like that. It's, it looks fun for the kids. Uh, got the icing for cakes and cookies. This is going to be for the cupcakes. And it comes with this little thing right there so you can like make it look real decorative. So it comes with black and orange. Like I said, we're going to be making the cupcakes. And I also got little cupcake cups. And it was Sasha's idea. Sasha's idea to all dress up like witches and make these cupcakes and kind of film it for a vlog or for Instagram or something like that. So that's why they got these little hats. Because I already have my hat. So that they can be in the kitchen wearing these and it's going to look like we're cooking up something. Some type of magic brew or potion or whatever. But it's really going to be just cupcakes. So that's going to be fun. Um, oh, I also got the pink candy melt. And this is going to be for the brain candy. I didn't realize that we got red. But it's going to be to make brain candies. So you might even stick them on top of the one of the cupcakes. Okay, I'm almost done with the Michael stuff. So, these are some glass skulls and bones. They're little mini crystal skulls. Little miniature crystal skulls, y'all. I know I have to do it. I'm gonna take them out of the package. Thank you, Terry. Take a sprinkle. Appreciate you, Terry. Thank you, Terry. These little cute plastic crystal skulls. Wait till you see what I'm going to do with it. You also have these little bones. So, I also, that's in the miniature section, like where you go into Michael's and they have all the miniature items for like the little cemetery. I also got 
these potion earrings. They're just full of glitter and some little magic potions. They have them in purple too at Michael's. I think one of my kids are gonna steal these from me. That's okay. Okay, so I also got this out of the miniature section. It's a crystal ball. Isn't it cute? It's like gold skull hands on it. So I'm gonna be making something with this and the miniature items. You're gonna see it's gonna be so cool. I also got these in the miniature section. Look at that, y'all. So, can't wait to make what I'm gonna make. I'm probably gonna do it as a, a craft or something on my other channel, or maybe this channel, who knows? That's gonna be fun. Then I got this to go with it. The last thing from Michaels, I got this really pretty carved out coffin. And it's like Dia de los Muertos, but there's cats. And there's a cat and a skull. So it's like $2.99. And it lights up. Like there's a little switch in the back to turn on a light. So it's decoration. So I'm going to paint this. I'm probably going to do it pink and black. Or just pink and white or pink and gold, and it's gonna go back here. That's gonna be cool. I missed out on all the cool pink um, things, like Halloween stuff at Michael's. I think you can order some online, but not a lot, unless they haven't stocked them up yet where I live, but I can make my own stuff. All right, so let's get into the local grocery store haul. Okay, they had better stuff at the grocery store. Look. This is a wax warmer. Our favorites. You can put oil or wax in here. It's a ceramic warmer. And she cute and you just place the and you plug this up and turn it on and the, the light comes on inside so it's also a night light this was only $5.99 can you believe that and it's ceramic this is only $5.99 in the grocery store I was like what I have to get that um I'm trying to put it back in here without Bear with me. Okay. The next thing I got my local grocery store. I got a bunch of makeup remover wipes because they were really cheap. I got three of these. I picked up some cellar water by Garnier. So this is what I used to take off my makeup. Usually, um, Sasha likes to play in makeup, so I give her the cheap makeup wipe. This is what I use on mine. She uses it sometimes, but I like it. Also got some Eucerin Intensive Repair Lotion. I like to keep my skin moist, plus Sasha, um, she has dry skin, so she really needs that. And it's really good for dry skin, especially winter is coming up. Okay, so I got this pumpkin carving. I'm live. Come in. I'm doing ASMR. Come in. Come in. I'm doing ASMR. What's up? You want your candy? Sorry about that. So I got the pumpkin carving. And that's going to go into the ceramic warmer. I'm going to sit down. Pumpkin spice. Starbucks coffee. The Keurig box. 
limited edition. Let's move this up. I love um, pumpkin spice coffee. So um, they have these out now. Let's go get some. Um, okay, next, this is my Tuscany candle, and this one is The Witching Hour. It's a premium marbled wax with essential oils, cool vanilla and spooky noir night. I love, look at the little artwork on it. So I got this at Kroger, which is my local grocery store, and... It smells so good, and there's two wicks. It's really good, and I love the artwork on it. And if you are into saving jars, it's a you know a good jar to keep. I have two other candles, and then that's probably going to be it. So I got the "You Are the Pumpkin to My Spice" pumpkin spice candle. And y'all, these were super cheap. They were $6.99. Like, if you went to, like, Bath & Body Works, this would cost you, like, $24. But it's, like, very, very, very scented. And there's three wicks. It's about the same size, maybe a little bit smaller. But I made for $6.99. This is the Chesapeake Bay Candle Company. So, they usually sell these kind of like the grocery store. So, if you're looking to save money on your candles, hit the grocery store. And you can still get your fall candles and stuff like that. Um, this last one is kind of funny. So, we have Black Widow. And... It's just a bunch of spider webs and it's black wax, the silver top. And this is by Candlelight. This is the name of the company, Candlelight. So there's different brands. Oh, this one smells so good. It smells like a sweet, perfumey, floral, and then some type of sugar, sugary snack. Um, so like candy perfume and a slight floral and it's really it just smells like you could burn this any time of year it's just really pretty smell i think it's because they named it black widow it's supposed to smell like a woman with perfume on or something but this is this is probably my favorite scent out of the ones that i bought okay all right oh i also bought some conditioner from my hair and I could not resist even though I'm not supposed to be buying any more mugs I got a cauldron mug and this is by Holiday Home and this is like seven dollars at my local grocery store so and look at the little feet it's ceramic I'm gonna go ahead and take that off so this was only seven dollars I saw some on Amazon. If y'all want to order some, I do have, like, I'll put my Amazon suggestions up there. I have, like, so many little idea suggestion um, boards. But I do have a cup similar to this, and I'll try to link it below if y'all really like this. I think I might have ordered one on Amazon, but it's probably going to take forever to get here, like, till next week. But... I already bought me one, so I'll have two. Maybe I'll give one away or keep it for decoration or something. But um, it's a mug. It's you know you can drink out of it and everything was off there with all the other mugs. So I've always wanted a cauldron um, with the feet mug, and I finally found one just sitting there waiting on me. And I think it's. I don't know how many ounces, but it's pretty big. You can fit a lot. Like the cup I'm drinking out of now is a little bit bigger, but this thing is huge. It's like a this one is like a black skull. <laughs> but this is huge. And so it's probably like sorry. 20 ounces or more. <sighs> so good. I got um 
I have mocha coffee with pumpkin spice um, flavoring. So, that is my haul, you guys. That's everything that I bought. Um, I got all of this today. And I needed it all. Because um, I'm going to use all of it. Every single day. Okay. You love the cauldron? Oh. Well, we burn candles a lot in the house, so candles really only last about a week around here or less, depending on how long we let them burn. So it's like um, these candles will be gone by next week, and I'll have to go get some more. But I don't mind because I love the ambiance that candles create. It's like it's so pretty. Um, I would light one, but I don't remember where I put my. Oh, I just found it. Let's see if we can light one up for you guys. I'm going to light the pumpkin spice for you guys. So, oops, sorry y'all. I hope that it's not too loud. I don't know what this mic is sounding like over there. So, I'm just gonna set it down. I don't wanna set it right there because I'm burning on his. I'll have to move my roses from here. This there. So the pretty. there there yes we'll have some ambiance you just smelled pumpkins you did I think that was mental I think that was mental so I want to try these on y'all doing i'm gonna you know um you're so happy that you're back uh, you happy i'm back thank you nasty badger thank you okay so very cute for halloween or you know october i will see unless someone takes them from me before i can wear it like my children. Your scented candle creates black soot around air vents. Oh no. Um, you know what I've noticed? Sorry, I'll turn that off. Wooden wick candles are way better at burning without leaving that soot. And um also they have these candle kits where you can buy a snuffer, the little scissors to cut the wick, and also um, one other thing, I don't know what it is, but when you get ready to relight your candle, you're supposed to cut that top part of the wick off, and then that won't happen. But if you just go get wooden um, crackling wick candles, which I do have, then you only have that problem. So I think I do have that listed on one of my Amazon um, suggestions um, to purchase. So I'll try to link that below. It's my spiritual suggestions, um, spiritual product suggestions from Amazon. Um, yeah, yeah. Okay. You like my older muk mukbang video? <laughs> I'm so cute. Thank you. Well, hopefully I'm still cute. 
me put this on. Yes, darling. I'm gonna try to still be cute for you. I look like a unicorn and a witch, a witch unicorn. So I kind of like this veil. Like I'm feeling this veil. I wish it was more like this. What do y'all think? And it sounds weird too, but I'm feeling this veil. <laughs> How are you, darling? Y'all, I actually got to go to my other channel. But I had so much fun here with y'all. And thank you for watching. And I hope you liked my haul. Maybe got you in the mood to go shopping. Get you some spooky stuff yourself. And have fun playing all of your spooky stuff. Oh, I also picked up, I forgot to show y'all this, but it's just some packing tape. I also got some of that. And always need that. Sending out packages, because I gotta do packages later. And yeah, so thank y'all so much. I'll see y'all later. I'm going to. Um, probably go on the other channels, but I will definitely try to link the stuff that I was talking about below in the description so y'all can have it in case you are wondering. Okay. I will come back. I will be back, Nasty Badger. <laughs> and like in the permanent comments, y'all go ahead and put like some type of request. I know someone that wants to do like an eating video. What do y'all want me to eat? Um, FYI, I'm vegan, so I can't eat everything unless it's like a substitute. So just let me know. I'm, I might just do it. You said I'm really, I'm ready for a British wedding. A, a Halloween wedding. Yes. I need more feathers. I need more feathers. I would definitely wear this for real though if it was like all black. Purple is not my color. This is not mine. You're vegan now too, Nasty Badger? Wow. We have so much in common. I wonder why you went vegan. You can tell me in the comments, in the in the permanent comments, and I'll read it, okay? That's cool. That's cool. All right. Well, tell me what your favorite vegan dish I should eat. Well, give me some suggestions. I got a lot of stuff in my freezer, in my fridge. All right, I'll see y'all later.